right guys and we're back it's been a grand total of about 20 seconds since i stopped the recording let's go i think it's just a route if i remember rightly yeah it's nothing in particular now down here there's an area we haven't got the fishing rod yet but you can do some fishing here there is a kind of big secret oh no it's not on this bit it's the next one but there is a kind of big secret oh i forgot about these these give you random items medium mp nice now in here we have meat for 300 bits wow no that is expensive digi mushrooms which you can just find for 600 bits so yeah we're not going to bother with that you can fish for these things here which you can either feed to your digimon or they have there is a later use for them um, and then down screen and to the left again, there's another you, uh, place you can fish with a super sort of kind of secret on it. Um, I can't remember if you need a better rod or not for that bit. Dan, if you're watching, did we need a better rod? I can't recall. Come on. That's it. That was easy enough. Everything got a boost that time. I mean, if you do enough random fights like this, it will eventually make a difference. Um, it all builds up, you know. Now, how much did the medium... Now, the original MP that we had, MP Floppy, did 500 MP. This one? Yeah, this is like 1,500. This is three times the size. So, I'm not going to use that until we have no other choice or a much higher MP rating. Kunamon, come here. Rats grumble, grumble. Well, he's a grumbly sort then, isn't he? Ogamon, attack. Ah, no! I, uh... That was my fault. I pushed it once, but it kind of skipped over. So it takes you back to the previous screen if you run. Uh, I, I didn't intend that to happen at all. Ah, we're back to Beatamon. Modoki Beatamon. Okay. Uh, that basically tells you that they're not the ones that are going to move into the city. If it's not, if, like, we'll, we'll, if there is a Beatamon that can join the city, it will just be called Beatamon or Betamon. Whatever, you know, it wouldn't have that, that extra bit at the beginning. Wow, you hit me hard. That was very lucky. We need to go and rest up. We came close to death then. If he had hit us one more time with that bubble thing, we would have died. So we're going to head back up to the village. We're going to rest up. Now the digivolving uh, does occur... It's a time scale. The digivolving is a time scale. Um, it's like a few hours from the first form to the second. Wow, two so close together. Then it's something like a day between the second form and this form. Then it's something like three or five days till the next one and so on and so forth. It does get by very quickly to try not to fight anything so we can go and rest up without interruption from any of these guys. I tell you what, it is damn fine to be recording again. I haven't been recording for just under a week, about a week, about a week I haven't recorded for. And seriously, this feels awesome to record again. It, 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 I was, I was, almost, I was pretty much having, well, not withdrawal symptoms, but I mean, I could watch things on on the computer still, um, but even then, I was like really bored, like super, super bored. I love recording. I love doing this. It's a lot of fun. 
He just ran through a fence. So that's a how much are you... I keep pressing select to jump, open up the menu. Uh, okay, so 500 and 300. See how much you rest up, shall we? So 500 and 300. Show us what you got. So 500 percent there. Yeah, so 300 on both. Ooh, we maxed out. Cool. Time of day. It's coming up to noon. Yeah, the clock. It a little weird. You've got your hand, which is basically your hours, and then that yellow dot, which is your time of day. But right now, it's about 10 or 11 o'clock. Hold on. Yeah, that was 11 o'clock, I would say, now. Um, purple is morning, the brownish thing is evening, and then you've got the middle of the night. So the clock itself is a 24-hour clock. I don't know how many hours there are in a in a Digimon day, but let's let's give you a tiny bit more health, Ogimon. I'm gonna give you a tiny bit more health. Anything? No. Guys, do you remember on the pay first episode? I said there was a second one that you can get as a starter. I remember its name now, Gobumon. Uh, Give him the digi mushrooms, Gobumon. That was the other starter you get. There we go, over a thousand HP. It's good enough for me. Come on, Gobumon. Bite. This is my territory. Yeah, well I say, Ogumon, take his territory now. Yes, our health is down because we didn't actually heal up after uh, putting the total health up. Wow, he did a big chunk of damage then. We really need to work on our defense. He just did like 300 damage to us. Alright, back up to the training area, Ogamon. I know you're not going to like it being a rookie based one, but it, we need to because you're getting whooped. You're a dinosaur and you have no defense. Boom. Come on. I need anything? Nope. Alright, let's do some more. I hope that didn't hurt too much, oh, come on. Just tired? Oh, just hungry, rather? Yeah, only hungry, nothing else. Give you some more mushroom. And you need a poo. And you're still hungry. We'll have a poo and you can have some more food. We are running low on meat, though. That is one of the things with um, training. I believe they tend to want to eat more, which makes sense. You know, if you're working at the gym, you tend to get hungry, don't you? Oh, thank you. If you feed them when they don't need it, their discipline will go down. But there are times when you kind of need to force feed them a lot. Um, like if you want to a particular type of Digimon that weighs in a, a great deal of weight that you need to make sure he's overfed when he evolves things like that there's lots and lots and lots and lots of different factors that can affect how they did evolve is that all you need it is you may sleep Ogumon no one's watching it's fine go sleep good boy
Let's get you some more training done. You're hungry. Well, good job we're going to get some more soon. Please only need the one. Good. Do you need a poo? No. Next time you're hungry, you'll need a poo. We're going to be moving on. Nothing. Wow. He's really going through the training right now. It doesn't need anything. Finally. Come on. Hey. Oh, you don't need a poo, do you? Yeah, that'd be why he didn't stop. I went to turn around to let him go poo. To let him have a poo, but... Obviously he doesn't need one. I got meat. Oops. I just praised him. His uh, discipline just went down a little bit, but his happiness went up. You know, I could discipline him completely and entirely until his bar is full and um, then give him the happy mushroom that would restore his happiness or if their happiness is particularly low a little white butterfly will start flying around them and if you stand still they'll kind of just gaze up at the sky and look it look like they've got no brain at all <laughs> um, and they'll get happy and their happiness will increase We beat you last time, we'll beat you again. Come on. Okimon, go! And again, no quarter. Come on. There we go, Okimon, come on. Don't let him hit you. Well, that's not too bad. Not the uh, one that did a lot of damage to us, though. So we have no idea against that attack. But it does look like you're a lot better off for the training. Nice job, Ogumon. <sighs> Couldn't you have gone when we were up there? Seriously. But when you get the option to buy porta potties, stock up. <laughs> Seriously, it makes all this back and forth that much easier. Oh, yeah, go have a poo in the bank. <laughs> right, here we go again. Look, you realise you just gave the other one a chance to come back again, right? <laughs> he didn't hear it, but he just growled at me. That's a sort of growling cheer when I said that to him. <laughs> we beat you, we'll beat you again. Go, Ogamon! Yeah, first hit to Ogamon, first blood. Come on, Ogamon. Second blood. Third blood. He hasn't even had a chance to attack us yet. That was not quite as strong as it was. It was like, what, 300 before? Something along those lines? So that's a lot better. No items, no moves. It's alright, Ogamon. It's okay. I know a place where we can get a move for you, but I don't know if we're able to beat them yet. Come on, Ogimon. No, don't get hit, Ogimon. Don't get hit. We can't afford to lose again. 
Come on, all that attack, that's it. Don't give him a chance to rally himself. Come on. Attack him. Attack, what are you waiting for? Oh, come on. Come on. That was a close one, guys. Jeez, that was really close. Oh. Oh, come on, Ogumon. Crying out loud. We've only got one bandage left. Soon to be none. I seriously haven't known them to get injured this often. I mean, in the past when I've played the game, uh, over the many years that I've liked, liked this game, and you know, I've known him to I've known them to get injured like three times the entire gameplay, <laughs> and and now I've got two in the space of what an hour from doing twenty minute episodes. We need the bandage, please. Thank you. Here you go, Ogimon. Oh, just a note, guys. I know many of you probably played it. Many of you have got the interest in playing it because of how old it is, but you'd like to watch it and all that. But just on the off chance that there is someone else who wants to play this, you should know if... Um, a Digimon refuses an item that you've given them, discipline them, and then offer the item to them again. They'll take it then. Rest. And now he's hungry. Hmm. I hope it's sleeping time for you soon, Ogamon, because we're running low on food again. May even have to go and visit that, that vending machine. Oof. Those prices, no chance. It's like Digimon Wells in, in um, National Debt or something. The National Digimon Debt. Prices are skyrocketing. How are we doing? Almost fully healed. Although he's going to be asleep soon. Come on. There we go. Oh, he's evolving. He's evolving. Oh, oh, what we're going to get? What we're going to get? I think Greymon or Centurion. Greymon or Centurion. They are my guesses. Oh, Magnamon. Is it Magnamon? I, I don't get this one that often. Uh, let's have a look at him, shall we? Miramon. Sorry, Miramon. His MP has gone up dramatically, as you can see. HP just a tiny bit. Some of his other stats have gone up, which is good. His offense is up. Um... Let's see if he's brought any new moves of him. No, he hasn't. So he's only got Spitball. His special move is... Oh, Spitfire, sorry. His special move is now Fireball. It's quite awesome. Uh, oh, yeah, when do you sleep? You're active during sunset, which is now. Oh, he's a noisy running person. Every time he takes steps, it's like boom, 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 boom. I know you guys can't hear it. we at the time when we can no not yet all right let's go and see if we can fight someone this is actually yeah as I say I don't normally get this one and I don't think I've ever without using like a, 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 a cheap disc back when I had it on the PSX itself as, a, as opposed to an emulator without cheats I don't think I've ever um, had all the poke all the uh, Digimon, the Pokemon. I don't think I've ever had all the Digimon ev evolutions. Man, come on! 
Really? Thank you. Took you long enough. There we go. Interrupt his attacks. Perfect. Keep him on the defensive. Don't let him use his offensive at all. Perfect. The Mermon here is made of fire or lava or something to that effect. We're going to wait until it's time for him to sleep. Then we shall try taking on that Digimon again. I think what we're going to do after this battle, we're going to go ahead, work on his defensive skills. Wow. Yeah, work on his defensive, because that was our biggest issue. Um, please don't tell me you're injured. Ah, oh, I saw the M for Mirman. Dropped a small recovery. Oh, yeah, so we're going to go ahead, work on his defensive, till it's time to sleep, and we'll go take him on. Really? I don't have anything to feed you. Oh, I do. I have one meat. This is all you get, I'm afraid. It wasn't enough. There's no mushrooms. I'm sorry, dude. The problems with having a bigger Digimon in the early stages. Food management. Anything else? I'm gonna have to keep checking now because it won't always show because the food one's there. It's like it will switch between them. But you can't just assume because it's only showing you one that it's ready. Ah, the food one's gone now. After a while that will happen, but it's not good to go without. I mean, he had one food, but. Oh, I'm overrunning again. Alright, guys, well. I'm going to end it off here. I'd like to say thank you very much for watching. Let me know if you're enjoying this in the comments section below. And I'll see you guys next time. I'm just run into the toilet real quick. And there we go. Alright guys, well, thank you. On that note, we're going to be going. I'm gonna, I've got time to record, I think, one more. That'll be like, what, four episodes? Yeah, and then I've got to go out and do the school one. So I think that's a nice thing, nice uh, way to round off the day. Or at least the my free time part of it. <laughs> All right, guys, so uh, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Thanks, guys. Bye.